Hey guys, this is Tazza Terrible and we are back with another Call of Duty World War 2 video and in today's World War 2 video we're going ahead and have a look at my three favourite best snipers to use in Call of Duty World War 2. We've also got a supply drop opening at the end of the video so definitely stick around for that but if you are new to the channel then don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss a single Call of Duty video. Just want to start off the video by saying a massive thank you to everyone who subscribed, watched my videos, and give me a thumbs up. It helps the channel so much. I really do appreciate it. Right, let's jump straight into Major Howard's orders before we look at these three best snipers. And today we've got the Disruptor Epic Combat Shotgun variant. To unlock this one, all you have to do is get 15 multi kills with shotguns. I recommend getting the Combat Shotgun. Going on shipment, you can get this 15 kills so easily to unlock the Disruptor Epic Combat Shotgun. And isn't it funny, we're doing this best sniper video, we go over to the Quartermaster and there's a sniper in there. So it's a really good one too, it's the SDK 9mm sniper rifle. To unlock this one, all you have to do is get 50 sniper rifle kills and you've got an hour to get these 50 kills in and it's going to cost you 5,000 army credits. The SDK, the SDK sorry, 9mm is one of the better snipers, it's probably one of the best snipers in Call of Duty World War 2. So I definitely recommend using those 5,000 army credits get you getting the 50 kills under an hour and that sniper is yours definitely worthwhile collecting okay now let's have a look at these three favorite snipers in call of duty world war 2 these are my three best in my opinion but let me know in the comment section what are your three favorite snipers in world war 2 well my first one is the ptrs 41 this is a world war 2 basic barrett 50 cal now it does say in the Spot in the little comment section below the weapon, semi-automatic sniper rifle that one shot kills on every part of the body at cost of slowest ADS transition time in class. So basically, ADS speed is so slow, but it doesn't matter, you can hit someone anywhere, in the finger, on the toe, and it's a one shot kill. One of the best snipers in the game for that reason, just because you hit someone anywhere and it's an instant death, instant kill. So that is why I've put that in my top three sniper rifles in Call of Duty World War II. And moving on over to our second best sniper rifle in World War II, and this is the Freeline Rifle. This is an awesome sniper rifle, so good. The sights on it are awesome, the original scope you get with it. Honestly, it's a one-shot kill anywhere above the sort of lower chest area. You will get a one-shot kill. But I love using this gun. It is definitely one of my favourite sniper rifles in the game. If you haven't used it already, or if you haven't unlocked it, try and unlock it, use it, and let me know how you get on with this gun because it's an absolute beast. Honestly, unlock the heroic free line, use it, and let me know how you get on. And our third and final sniper rifle, this is the one that we've just seen in the Quartermaster. This is the SDK 9mm. This one's an absolute beast. It says bolt action sniper rifle with built-in suppressor that offers a generous one-shot kill. Now this built-in suppressor is the reason that I've picked this one. There is another gun that you can get a built-in suppressor as well. I think it's the... Oh, I can't think of it. No, let's have a look. It is the Delisle, that's the other one. I didn't ca quite catch that, but this SDK 9mm is better than the Delisle in my opinion. It offers a very generous one-shot kill and with that built-in suppressor as well. Honestly, it's an absolute, it's probably my favourite sniper rifle in the whole of the game and definitely worthwhile being my top three without a shadow of a doubt. Anyway, let me know your top three snipers in the game. We're about to jump in. We've got 11 supply drops to drop, and this one's so good. So definitely watch this. Anyway, guys, let's jump straight into the supply drop opening. Wish me luck. Give me a thumbs up. Let's jump straight into it. Okay, then we are back. Now, look how populated this headquarters is. There's loads of people here. I mean, it's ridiculous. Look, the game is six, seven years old. Let's have a little look at the leaderboard. We've got a load of level 1000s here. If you're on there, cool. Anyway, let's jump, drop down these supply drops. We've got eight commons and three rares. Let's drop the commons first. We'll have one here. Come on. Wish me luck, guys. We need it. We need something decent out of these. And again, all duplicates. Yeah. Rubbish, rubbish. Look, that's. 
one, we haven't had a duplicate, but that is a common emblem. We don't care about that. We've got, we got Cracky here. He's, he looks like they're going to throw us a pie up down as well. There we go. Oh, here we go, Heroic. Oh, it's a uniform. Well, it's heroic something, which is good. So, I'm happy with that. It's good in the common to get in a heroic. Now, this is... That's quite a cool camo for launchers, but we never use launchers, so... It's a bit irrelevant. Right. We're going to drop the other ones in a different position, but let's drop the rest of these. Yeah, we're not going to worry about that artillery. Come on. Come on, let's get, come on, we've got two left, and then we're going to chuck the, oh, we got another heroic, what we got? Heroic. we got the warbird too, which we've already got, which is a shame, but unfortunately when you have got a lot of the variants, you will get duplicates. That's why we need the bribes back, bring the weapon bribes back. Anyway, right, we're going to run round here, we get these three, we're going to call them in round here on the beach. This guy, he's on the flat gun, taking out the planes. Fair play to him, right? Let's drop. Can we drop one round? Can we drop one up by this flat gun, maybe? Yep, we can. And we are. Here we go. Oh, we got another heroic, guys. What we got? What we got? Ooh, one we haven't got. So we got the Dynamo 2 toggle action. Epic. We'll have a little look at that. After we've dropped these other two supply drops. We're going to drop it here again. Because this seems to be good luck next to this flat guy. Oh, no. Trash. Yeah, that's what they are. It's trash. And our last one. We've got an epic. Tracker M26. I'm happy with that. So we've got the tracker and the dynamo. Let's have a little look at these. Come on. Let's have a look. Alright. So shotgun. Toggle action and the dynamo too. Okay. Cool. So I'm happy we've got a heroic. Not the greatest gun, but it's an extra variant that we haven't got. And then the M262 is a submachine gun. Where is it? There. So we've got the tracker. I'm happy with this, guys. Great. I'm happy with that. I've got to be only threw down 11 supply drops. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one.